3 2 defeat to Blackburn and almost a title decider. What do you make of today's game? Uh, well, first I want to say congratulations to Blackburn. I think they, they played a really good game. They, they stuck in it, uh, they stayed in the game, and they, I think they just scored a crucial moment, which kind of took the, this thing out of the game for us. And I, said, I think it was, a, it was a good game for for neutral to come down and watch. And girls gave it everything they had in, you know, in terms of the heat, in terms of the effort, so we can't fault them in, in terms of that. So I think it was a really good game, and it's just unlucky not to get the result today. A 2 1 lead at half time, and Blackburn came out probably the strongest side in the second half and like you say scored at two vital times yeah. how important it was for the girls point of view that they didn't let their heads drop and they kept pushing for the 90th minute to try and get back into the game uh, well to fact we said it to the girls at half time you know we were expecting Blackburn to come out with, with the response considering we had gone into one and like they say two ones that it's a dangerous score line so it was about the next score was going to give have a massive impact in terms of effort and energy and they scored it at a crucial time which meant you know they they were able to give that extra 10% which, which a goal can do that for you so which is unlucky for us and 1-0 up inside the first 10 minutes and a second goal heading to that was ruled out for offside what do you make of that one do you think it was the right decision uh, well I've not had a chance to look at it yet but so I can't really comment too much but I think another, again that's another crucial moment so if we look there I think we, we go in at 2-0 up it's a whole different game because they're going to start chasing and the game opens up a bit more and I think we're just unlucky that that was obviously ruled out. So we space the line. I think it was it was a tight call, but you know, at the minute they, they've said that they think it was the right decision, so we can't really <laughs> complain too much about it. And, and, it. and then after today, two away games to end the season away to Middlesbrough and then Bradford. How do you build from today's game? What do you learn from today's game? Take into that Middlesbrough trip next Sunday. Um, I like was said to the girls post the game. I think they've had a good season and. It's a 22-game season, and they've got to just, re- you know, take the positives out of the season and go and try and finish off the season. Now we started it, and all that hard work they've put in for the 30 odd games that they played this year, they, you know, they can't let it slip and try and get second place if, if that's what we can get at the minute. Which is obviously a, an add-on from what we came third last year. So again, is just realizing that we've had a good season and just going to finish it up for the last two games. And finally, on today's game. Not necessarily the result we wanted, but Rosie Axton, uh, her 50th goal for the club, which is a fantastic achievement. What did you make of that over the last three and a half years? Uh, again, we're going to say congratulations to Rosie, who's been a fantastic servant to the club. And obviously that's you know, emphasised by her again, the 50th goal, which is a massive achievement. You know, I'm lucky that we can get the result to, to match that. But again, all we can say is congratulations for, for a great achievement. Thanks very much. I'm lucky today. Cheers, guys. Thank you.